Good afternoon. My name is Larry Hebert. Welcome to St. Andrew's Church. We're here today to uh, promote the St. Andrew's Church Canada 150 Speaker Series. And in particular, the uh, session is going to be held next Wednesday evening here at 7 o'clock. And it's an evening of sports heritage. And it will feature uh, Dave Sissiano from the Sports Hall of Fame, an honored member several times. Harry Curtis also honored a couple times. And the Executive Director, Diane Emery. And all three will make presentations. It's about a two-hour evening. Uh, we'll have hot cider here and uh, no intermission. We'll just have breaks in between the speakers. We'll have a couple draws for books from the sports hall. And uh, people will just wander to the back of the church and pick up uh, the hot apple cider that Pierre has carefully prepared for us. And I uh, just want to introduce people to Pierre, who's standing at the door, uh, John Mason and Joyce, our minister, who are also members of the Restoration Committee. This committee came, it's kind of the restoration fundraising committee now. It came out of the, uh, the uh, I guess, restoration committee we had, and that was mainly to deal, deal with the ceiling when it fell down, and it's morphed into a fundraising committee, and also there's a separate building committee, which did a lot of the work to get the ceiling restored. But we still have a lot of work to do in the church, and so we're looking at this whole series as a series of uh, events where we're going to fundraise for the church and we're splitting the first one with the sports hall sharing the profits equally hopefully both organizations will share you know, a whole lot of money so we want to see a lot of people out uh, we are continuing this series march 2nd will be our next speaker and that will be derek bernie he's going to speak on an interesting topic and uh, we think with his background it'll be very attractive and that is uh, canada in a trump world and he's got extensive background, so it should be a great evening. We've got other speakers lined up. Bill Blakey, we're still finalizing a date. Should be around April 20th. And we have a couple other spirit speakers. Eric Gustafson's gonna do a gospel in his Elvis role uh, in May. And uh, we have two other speakers uh, dealing with Aboriginal issues. Cynthia Wesley Oscomo from uh, Lincoln University, who's there now Truth and Reconciliation Officer, is going to speak about the uh, 94 recommendations from the Truth and Reconciliation Commission. And we'll also have uh, the head of the Métis Nation of Ontario, the first female president, uh, later in the year. And we're going to do a feature one with uh, the uh, CKPR TBT history, which will be interesting to see the vast amount of things that have happened to the Dougal Empire over the years. So it's going to be an exciting series. We're looking forward to getting people out, seeing the church, and hopefully uh, contributing to our restoration fund and making the church even better and a great town and town place to be. Jeff, this is the poster. We have, as I said, Dave Sissiano, extensive hockey background. Uh, Dave will be here talking about those uh, kind of efforts taught around the world, a, a level five or level six coach in Hockey Canada and well recognized for his hockey ability, coaching the Thunder Bay Twins to an Allen Cup and the Flyers to the uh, supremacy twice in the junior hockey wars. So that should be great. Harry Kurz is a renowned coach in Hammershaw High School, taught uh, both wrestling and cycling and uh, certainly a couple of his key people, Scott Timmerman was on a couple championships and also uh, Kurt Harnett, who was the chef de Michon last year for the Olympic effort in Canada, in Brazil. Uh, he will um, also was taught by Harry and uh, he's won two silver medals uh, at the Olympics. So uh, Harry's got quite a good reputation and again been inducted in the hall. And of course, Executive Director Diane Emery, just a super expert on all areas of sport. And one of the things we're going to talk a little bit about, because it's not as well known today, but that was back in the old days, there was quite a significant church league in both hockey and uh, soccer and uh, disking was something I got to learn about the church. Every church you went to in the basement had a disking set up, so it was quite interesting. But a uh, yeah, very big league in terms of uh, hockey. Uh, it was in the 30s. It was really reported on. They had their own column in the uh, newspaper, and so it was quite extensive. So that's some of the things we'll be talking about on Thursday. As I said, there'll be draws for three different books, and we'll do those at the breaks between speakers, no intermission for the two hours. And as I said, Pierre has done a wonderful job and will do a wonderful job getting together a great, significant recipe. We're not, he won't tell us the ingredients, but uh, where we will be enjoying uh, the hot cider.